What I learned this week is not related to Panama. Well, you learned that Panama was thicker than you thought. <laughs> yeah, much thicker. Uh, it's also not related to Justin Trudeau. It's related to a new study that came out, which is kind of hammering home the same point that vaccines do not cause autism. Okay. So they did like a huge, another huge <sighs> oh long God. study of over 650,000 kids. And they realized that the, the, the significance of this study over any others was that not only did it find that vaccines don't cause autism, they also found that it doesn't trigger autism in kids who are who are at high risk to get autism. Okay. So that was sometimes an argument like, but what if my kid maybe could get autism more likely and a vaccine kind of like kicks it into gear? Okay. And they realized by studying this, it was like watching kids over over a decade and then following up with them. Um, and that's 650,000 kids again. Uh, yeah, no link. And I know there's like not a lot to say about this other than it's just like... Like that exhausted article that did so much damage. It's all based on oh. one study that the author has redacted that people always link back to there has now been I think this this 17 previous major studies that have found no link between vaccines and autism and sorry I shouldn't necessarily say like all vaccines this study and all those studies were on the MMR measles mumps and rubella, and rubella say it again vaccine. with me measles so, mumps and rubella but that's the one that all the, the kids get when they're young to, like, protect them yeah. from these diseases that they're at high risk from. Uh, so, yeah, I, I mean, like, I don't have anything else to say other than, like, stop spreading this false idea. It doesn't mean we can't say, hey, let's make sure vaccines are still safe and any new vaccines we should be but testing. stop claiming this. Yeah, it's really, it's no longer a point the scientific community you know, at this point, it's just like, it's done. It's and done. measles are back. Cute. Good job, everyone. <laughs> measles are back. Cute. And it seems like there's more celebrities than ever that are, like, supporting this notion. So that's a weird part of <sighs> the life world we live in and how how do we make people listen to science? Oh, my gosh. That's a con- consistent thing that we're going to be talking about for the rest of life. 